planet that we live in is a complicated balance of life and death, predator and prey. Join us as we delve and explore further about the world of ecology. The word ecology literally translates the study of home. Our home, the planet Earth. Today, we are here to clearly discuss more about you and me and living in the world around us. Now, what does it mean or what makes up an ecology? Did you know that you yourself is an ecosystem? You are an ecosystem to the thousands of microorganisms inside of you. The survival of species is dependent on the other living organisms and non-living organisms. This is called the interdependence. For example, humans cannot survive without plants to produce oxygen and the plants need carbon dioxide from humans. There are two factors of ecosystem. First one is biotic. Biotic is all living factors that affect another organisms or shapes the ecosystems in some way. The second factor of the ecosystems is abiotic. Non-living parts of the environment that can affect organisms such as the chemical and physical part of the environment. It includes light intensity, carbon dioxide concentration, temperature, moisture level, and the direction and intensity of the wind. Ecology, on the other hand, is not always about the environment, but also about the people. The thing about it is that every generation is different. Humans come and go. Humans have treated the planet or our ecology in various ways. From the man-eating caveman, to the bouncing, rocking, and lively living 19th century. It was fun at first, until it's not. The ecosystem will most likely fall if we didn't take care of it. And the earth won't be habitable enough for us humans anymore. Let's save the earth and start within ourselves. This is just simple and little act we could do for our planet. But it could bring such a great impact for our sustainable future. Because we do believe little changes makes big difference.